going on? How you guys doing? It is YouTube Wednesday, so you know what that means. We got another video for you. Actually, why did I say we? It's me. It's not we. It's me. Nah, I'm, I'm kidding. It's not about me. But, we got another video for you. Um, it's called Moving Day slash What If. So, here's the video. Check it out. Like, subscribe, comment, try to get us to 50 subscribers, people. Come on, check out the video. Thank you. Y'all still here? Come on, man, check out the video. Let's go, man. Come on, man. Hey, hey, yeah. All right. Good morning, good evening, whatever it is. Hopefully this is good. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on a second now. Y'all going a little crazy on me. All right. Once again, good morning, good evening, whatever it is. I hopefully that is good for y'all. So I just want to do a little bit of a little series, right? That uh, I want to entitle "Moving Day" because I believe that there are people out there who want to do what I did and not try to brag about us by. <laughs> You know, you know, you know, you know, you know. But I believe that there are people out there who want to truly move from where they are now to somewhere else. And, and I would tell you, go ahead and do it. Just do it. Just do it. But since I'm going to make this into a little series, that's not the only tip I'm going to give for y'all. All right? That was just a, that was just a free nugget, you know. Like um uh like uh, one of the ministers from my church always says he goes Charlie, that was a free nugget, thank you, but so that was a free nugget for y'all right, but so today I want to talk about what if, what if, now, whenever you're moving right, you gotta have a plan, you gotta you gotta you gotta sort through it all, even in your mind you gotta sort through it, and your mind is gonna play the trickiest. The trickiest game, that's not even a real word, but it's going to play the trickiest game on you. But you got to decide your what if, right? And you got to decide if you're going to bypass that what if, right? So let's get into it, right? Some what ifs. What if I'm not successful? What if I leave a good job and life turns out bad? What if, what if I go homeless? What if, um... Uh, what if, what if, what if, what if, you name a what if, that's what what if we talking about. So let me tell y'all something. If you're so worried about the what if, you've already made up in your mind that you're not going to move. You already made up in your mind that you're not going to even do it. You already made up in your mind and said, you know what, I ain't going because A, B, C, D would happen. But I'm here to tell y'all, you can't think about the what if. You can't think about, uh, oh, well, if I if I leave my good job and then something may happen to me or this or that. You can't think about that. All of that, you got to put it in the back of your mind. You got to put it in the back of your head just like, ah, all the way back there. That's what y'all got to do. You can't think about the what ifs. You can't think about, oh, uh, if I do, this may happen or that may happen. Can't think about that. Sorry about that. But you can't think about that. Because once you're thinking about that, you've already decided in your mind you're not going to go. Yes, I truly believe. You've already decided in your mind that you're already not going to go. You've already decided that. So, I'm here to tell y'all that when you're when you thought about moving right cuz it cuz everything begins with a thought every every action that you do whatever it is it always begins with a thought it always begins with a a, a thought in your mind so in your mind you process the thought oh hey i want to move because of new york is too expensive or new york is too this or la is too this or chicago is too this or wherever you're from atlanta is too this uh florida uh, North Carolina, South Carolina, Virginia, whatever, whatever state you're from. If you set in your mind, say, you know what, I want something different. I want something 
I want something. I want to experience something different. And if you're young, oh my goodness. If you're young, let me tell you something. If you're young, you've got to explore the world. We have 50 states in the United States. I mean, if you want to go live outside the country to Europe, uh, uh, I was about to say Africa. Uh, Africa, Asia, um, New Zealand, uh, Australia, China, Japan. If you want to do that, pray super hard before you go because that's major. That's major, major. But I'm talking about the 50 states, right? We got Seattle. You got L.A. I mean, you got uh, you got Washington. You got you got uh, California. You got Texas. You got Oklahoma. You got Utah. You got uh, New York. You got Maine. You have everything else that I did not even mention. You have all of those to explore. So if you're young, I would tell you, go explore. It's just you. It's just you. Go explore. Go figure out what life has. And there may be people like, well, you know, you really don't got to figure out life just to live it. Stop. Figure out life. Every path that we're going to take in life is always going to be different from the next person. It's always going to be different from your mom. It's always going to be different from your daddy. It's always going to be different from your sisters. It's always going to be different from your brothers. It's always going to be different from your pastors. It's always going to be different from somebody else. But you yourself, you got to learn how to take that path for yourself and, and throw... Throw the what ifs in the back burner. Just mm, ah, throw them out. You know, you shouldn't be thinking about a what if. You shouldn't. I know a lot of people, and I'm going to say like this. I know a lot of people who wish they did what I did. And it's not to brag or boast about that, so don't. No. The reason why I say that is because a lot of people don't like the job that they're in. A lot of people don't like the state they're in. A lot of people just don't like the surroundings that they're in. So here's my advice. Plan it out. That's going to be part two. The plan. Part two. So please stick to that. The so moving day, the plan. That's what it is. Uh, and eventually at the end, I'm going to talk to you about Fort Worth. So hopefully this lasts until whenever so I can get into Fort Worth to tell y'all all about it. All right. Um, I don't know how long this going series is gonna go, but that I'm just I'm just I'm just giving y'all some nuggets, okay? I'm throwing out some nuggets to y'all. But seriously, wherever you plan to move, wherever you plan to go, don't think about the what is. Don't think about what can happen if dot dot dot. Let me tell you something. If I thought about the fact that I would have um I would not have a job automatically. If I thought about the fact that um, that I might have been homeless, that I might have been uh, struggling, uh, can't come up with cash, can't do this, I wouldn't have done it. I would have stayed in New York, most likely. I would have stayed in New York where I was at, working the job that I hate with the people that were just negative. If that was the case, I would have done that. But I didn't. I just moved. I just did it. I, I did have a plan. People was like, oh, uh, yeah, you know, you should have had a plan. I did have a plan. And that's going to be in next week's uh, video. Um, but seriously, I did have a plan. And my plan was ABCDFG. That's in next week's video, though. But if I thought about the what ifs, <laughs> I lost my track of train of thought, sorry. But if I thought about the what if that. Oh, I might have been doing this, or this may happen, or that may happen. No. If I thought about that, I wouldn't have moved. I wouldn't have moved. Um, uh, I really wouldn't have. I would have been still in the same place that I'm, that I'm in. Well, that I was in. And that's it. But, I said, you know what? Let me plan this out. Forget about the what ifs. Forget about what can happen. Forget about what may happen. Forget about all of that. Put that in the back burner. Come alongside with me. It's time to plan. It's time to make the plan. Stick to part two, alright? Come back for part two. Please come back for part two. Share this video. Uh, like, subscribe. I'm trying to get my followers up to at least 50 followers. I want at least 50 followers by December. By the end of December. I want at least 50 followers. Please. That's all I want. Just 50. I'll take 50. 
I mean, if you y'all could give me a little bit more, I'm cool with that. But at least 50. Come on now. Uh, so that's it. Um, I'll talk to y'all next time. So be be blessed. Let's stress. Let's go out and do it. Let's conquer it. We got this. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Ah.